Uh, good morning, uh, everyone. Uh, with this uh, presentation, I uh, will try to give a correlation between undergoing uh, creation research on uh, assessment of existing uh, bridges and the objectives of the working group uh, two. So uh, the first step uh, of the research would be to identify monitoring uh, methods. As a wider term, monitoring comprises uh, standard inspection techniques, which are performed periodically, then uh, periodic but long-term monitoring, and uh, of course, continuous uh, monitoring with sensors, but uh, additionally data transfer and analysis uh, equipment. The, the second step of uh, research uh, would be uh, categorize performance indicators that are important for uh, efficient and uh, effective um, performance of arch uh, bridges. They can be grouped as uh, structural, environmental, and uh, uh, economic ones. And then uh, the third step uh, would be uh, to define types of structural performances that are important for arch uh, bridges. Uh, assessment of uh, uh, arch bridges um, consists of revealing uh, corrosion progress, uh, defining, assessing its serviceability, traffic capacity, seismic performance, uh, performance due to wind load, and uh, finding out uh, the remaining uh, durability of the uh, bridge. Between each step, we can, uh, in fact, find uh, the link uh, to the objectives of the working group uh, two. Uh, between the step one and the step uh, two, we have to define which monitoring method is to be used to measure, to measure certain quantity in order to define a perf performance uh, indicator, and their uncertainties in measure data and in collecting data may uh, appear. I will give uh, the example of uh, reinforced concrete uh, arch uh, bridges. We have uh, four bridges of the first uh, generation, Shibanek Bridge built in 1966. Then we have Park Bridge built in 1968, but in 1999 it was uh, repaired when the uh, superstructure, the old pre-stressed concrete superstructure was completely uh, dismantled and replaced with a steel structure. And then we have two Kirk uh, uh, bridges. Uh, at that time, uh, to achieve such uh, exceptional uh, spans, very small concrete covers were used uh, for those uh, bridges, so it is in, in fact other maintenance from the very uh, be beginning. Then we have a second generation, uh, Maslenica and Skradin bridges are the bridges for our new highway, and uh, uh, the new one, Cetina bridge for the uh, state uh, uh, road. So uh, here I will uh, give you some uh, uh, details of some uh, standard inspections uh, techniques that were performed uh, on those uh, bridges. Uh, some uh, geometrical surveying, visual inspections, loading tests, some uh, non-destructive or destructive and semi-destructive uh, techniques. What we need to do here is to collect experience from previous <laughs> inspections and uh, uh, establish regular inspection uh, and include any other necessary uh, technique. Um, uh, bridges of the second generation are equipped uh, with uh, sensors, and in fact, for all three of them, we can uh, measure displacements, corrosion, progress, humidity, also strain and temperature. Additionally, uh, for Maslenica bridge, we can measure wind direction and uh, speed. And uh, at the old uh, Kirk bridge, uh, at uh, two piers of a smaller arch, uh, fi uh, fiber sens sensors were, uh, uh, fiber optical sensors were installed during the repair to measure uh, strain and uh, temperature. What we need uh, here is, in fact, to revive this monitoring uh, system because, uh, unfortunately, uh, due to the limited budget, it's not uh, active. Here you can see details from uh, our arch uh, bridges. Uh, some details for the old, from the old ones, and uh, uh, let's say from the bridges of the second uh, generation example of um, uh, sensors at uh, Skradin uh, uh, Bridge, uh, and complete overview of uh, uh, um, repairs, investigations, inspections, uh, assessment and monitoring is uh, presented uh, in the uh, paper. Uh, now we go uh, to the step uh, between the step two and the uh, step uh, three. 
uh, while uh, capturing all the indicators that affect certain structural uh, performance. Uh, here, uh, uncertainties in, combine, in combining those appropriate indicators uh, may uh, appear and may uh, 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 should be treated uh, 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 appropriately. I will emphasize his, here that the interaction between those uh, structural, environmental, and economic uh, parameters is uh, uh, definitely uh, necessary. And I will give the example of seismic performance of reinforced concrete arch uh, bridges. This is a table showing uh, the data collection on uh, structural uh, indicators, geometry, details, materials. Uh, but of course, they are influenced with uh, environmental uh, parameters because, uh, uh, for example, the changes of the cross-section dimensions or uh, the effective reinforcement in a certain cross-section uh, will be influenced with, uh, uh, for example, uh, combined uh, uh, wind uh, and uh, sea salt uh, action and deterioration uh, processes accordingly. And uh, the economic parameter is, is hidden, in fact, in those uh, knowledge uh, level, because uh, higher knowledge level uh, for a bridge of uh, critical importance will require more extensive uh, inspection works and, of course, comprehensive uh, bridge monitoring. As we are always uh, limited with the, uh, with the budget, uh, it is of great importance to establish uh, the most significant locations at the Arch Bridge, uh, at the Arch bridge to be uh, inspected. This is uh, an, exam an example of the most uh, important cross-sections for seismic uh, uh, performance uh, the abutment, the crown, one fourth of the arch span, and the extremities of column uh, uh, are the most uh, uh, important. And at the end, instead of conclusions, I will give a flow chart of the activity plan for arch bridges, but in fact, it can be applied uh, to any kind of uh, uh, structure. After collecting experience uh, from previous uh, inspections, we have to categorize monitoring methods, performance indicators, structural performance uh, types. Uh, then uh, the uncertainties need to be appropriately uh, treated within a theoretical framework of the cost uh, uh, action. And to reach the final goal, uh, to quantify the link between the monitoring uh, types and uh, structural uh, performances. Thank you very much for your attention.